All right, welcome to Man Kitchen Recipes. I'm Kevin. And today, as you know from the title, I am going to do a beer can Cornish game hen with a Coke. Any of you have uh, been at my channel very long, you'll know years ago I did a beer can chicken video. Beer can chicken is amazing, but hey, if you've been using beer, like in my video, I tell you, you've been doing it wrong this whole time because you need to use Coke or orange or a soda because it's way better. Don't ask me why. It just seems more flavorful, more tender and juicy than a beer. All right, so I'm gonna use a Coke and a Cornish game hen, that's right. So I'm gonna go inside, let's go in there and I'll show you, we'll prepare it and then we'll come back out. We'll get it on the uh, Brisk It 580. We're gonna smoke today at 325 degrees, all right? Let's get this thing ready, get it in there. All right, so here's our little Cornish game hen. Look how little that guy is. All right, so we're gonna beer can this, uh, Coke can this chicken, this uh, game hen. So first thing I'm gonna do, I don't know if you watched my uh, other video with the uh, Comfy 12 and one, but I'm gonna put salt, pepper, garlic on this bud boy right here, okay? And then the next, and then the next thing I'm going to put is Uncle Steve's uh, smoke bomb. Uh, <laughs> I put this on that rotisserie chicken, and let me tell you what, the SPG and the smoke bomb, wow, awesome, awesome flavor. So that's what we're going to go with with this uh, beer can, Coke can game hen. Get under his little armpits here. I do need to flip it over. Okay. A little olive oil spray, do some good stuff. Okay, more smoke bomb on the front. All right, there we go. Now, what's next? Well, we got to get our uh, Coke can, right? So I'm using um, I'm using one of these little, the little small cokes. It's not the uh, full Coke. It's a little uh, seven and a half ounce can. And uh, you know what? Uh, usually when you do a beer can chicken or Coke can chicken, you have to pour some out. So I'm actually going to take a, take a big sip of this. All right. <laughs> and I got this crazy idea. I mean, I've been on this uh, bourbon kick, right? So, uh, do they make a, do they, do you drink whiskey and Coke? <laughs> I'm gonna put a little bit of whiskey in here, a little uh, bourbon inside this Coke can, not much. Maybe a half an ounce. All right, let me get that shook up a little bit. I'm gonna give that a little taste. Hold on. Yeah, that's not too bad. Okay, so we're gonna do a uh, Beer can, uh, Coke, and Jim Beam, uh, Coke and bourbon game hen. All right, so this is how we do it, okay? And it's kind of funny because I'm thinking this is all I'm going to need to do, and I'm going to have to touch this little bird up, but I think I just need to set this on top of here. Okay, it just fits, and I think that's going to sit in the grill just right, just like that. Maybe I'll tie his arms up. All right, it kind of fell down and out of view, didn't it? Okay, so there it is. I think I'm gonna tie the, I'm gonna put a little piece of string and tie these up. All right, so we're gonna get this touched up and I'll meet you out at the grill. <laughs> Sorry, it just looks funny. I had to be careful walking out here. But there you go. That's my, actually, that's my uh, beer can, Coke and bourbon Cornish game hit. All right. All right, I'm gonna get this in the brisket 580 and let it go for, ah, till it's done. I'm gonna put a probe in there. Let's get it in there. All right, sorry about the glare, but this is, uh, the sun is almost directly behind us. And uh, you know, when I when I was gonna, when I had the idea of doing this beer can Cornish game hen, I wasn't sure how it was gonna stand up, but uh, it, it stands pretty good right here on this, uh, right on the Coke can. As long as they don't move it on the grate, I think we'll put it just like that. What do you think of that? <laughs> Look at that little guy. Oh, wait a minute. I got to put a probe in there, right? Yeah, this probe is a, a little large. Let me just stick it in right here. It's not much in there, so we'll see if that works. And on 
for 50 minutes. Oh, look at that guy, Your gal. <laughs> so the uh, temp reading here is 163. Let's just give it a double check over here. Showing 145 over there. Let me get it in here. Okay, 152. So I'm gonna spin this guy around. I don't think this is uh, being real accurate there. I will take that out. I'm going to try to spin this guy around. Ooh, there's a lot of juice right there. We're gonna let that go a little bit longer and uh, I'll just keep a check on it. So let me just check back here in the thigh. 156. 157. Okay, yeah, we're gonna let this go a little bit longer, but uh, that's not reading accurate. Okay, we've got some more glare. Anyway, it's been an hour and it is temping out just right. I'm gonna try to get this off of here, let it rest, and we'll cut into it. Here it is in the sunlight. <laughs> Look at that little guy. Here's my hand. <laughs> All right, cut into this in a minute. Right, this little uh, Cornish game hen. He's been resting for, I don't know, 10 or 10 minutes or so, 15 minutes. So let me get that can out of there. And I think what I'm gonna do is just uh, cut this thing in half. Well, first I better get that string out of there so I don't forget. Okay. I'm just gonna go down the breast. And just have it, just like that. <laughs> Have it halved. All right, look at that. Okay, and uh, let's see, what should we take a taste test of? A leg, a wing, cut a piece of the breast off maybe. All right, that looks good. I know I'm gonna want more though. <laughs> All right. I know it's got a bone in there somewhere. Right there. Whoa, that thing is falling apart. Okay, let's take a taste test of this Cornish game hen and uh, wrap this up. Okay, there you go. There is my beer can Cornish game hen right there. Look at that. Okay, and it wasn't beer, it was Coke with some bourbon in it. When I dumped out the, the can, you can really smell that bourbon. So anyway, I cut a piece of that breast meat off. Look at that. And this has a SPG and Uncle Steve's smoke bomb. I think it's a great combination for chicken, so it's got to be for this Cornish, Cornish game hen. There we go. Mm -hmm. mm. That is definitely tender and juicy. Great flavor. Hmm. Wow. I'm trying to see if I can pick up a hint of that bourbon. Huh. Not really. Anyway. Piece of the dark meat. Hmm. All right, there you go. Beer can, Cornish game hen with Coke and bourbon. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I hope you come back. We're going to be doing more videos. And I hope you have a great day. <laughs>